You know we are big dog lovers on PTO. I have my Bentley, Heather has Kevin and Lucy. That's right, and so we had to show you this photo that another dog lover sent in. Doug Jaffe of Latrobe says these are his golden retrievers, Virgil and Ace, showing their Steeler pride. Hope it helps against the Browns this Sunday. We're gonna yeah. need it after our loss Ooh, last weekend. Yes, we do. And of course, you know, our favorite dog on PTL is Penguin. He has been with us ever since he first arrived in Pittsburgh for the first leg of his training to become a canine companion for independence. And we have loved our visits with him every Friday Aww. on the show. He has grown so much, and it's gonna be really hard to say goodbye when he moves on to the next step in February. But we know it's for the best. We it's know it's for, for good. Best. Oh, and Another pup we love is Mikey Hook's little guy. This oh. is Wilson. Oh He's so cute. Remember, she got him back in November and asked our PTL friends to help name him. And oh. since the pandemic, so many people have adopted a dog and are learning it takes a lot of patience to raise a well-behaved dog. So Mikey, t Mikey Hood took Wilson out for some professional puppy training and a little fun, too. I'm bringing my pup Wilson to Unleashed in Gibsonia to get some tips on leash walking and for his first puppy social. So go ahead and take the leashes off your dogs. If every time you call me and you give me 50 bucks, the next time you call it, I'm gonna come. Owner Paul Anthony, a former canine officer, has been training dogs since the 80s. He says just like you take your car to a mechanic, you can bring your dog here for an expert tune-up. We take dogs in, in training classes. We socialize them like the, like the doggy daycare. We also do a board and train program where you give us your dog for two, three weeks. The dog comes out well trained, it's boarded here, it does daycare. So all we're doing here is we're just getting the dogs acclimated to, to the other dogs. Small dogs with big dogs, big dogs with small dogs. Wilson was a little unsure at first about the doggy social. He wasn't sure what to do. But soon enough, he joined in on the fun and made so many new friends. It's like the first day of kindergarten with a child. So, and, and, and they learn how to do it. Then pretty soon they're like, okay, get away from me, mom. We're good. Owners can't simulate this kind of a play at home. And remember, you need to say good every time you, you need to say that word. We brought him here mostly because I uh, wanted to have trained well-behaved dogs. Got two kids at home. So I just wanted to make sure we were being responsible. Here his two dogs, Lizzie and Bella, have mastered potty training and recall commands. During COVID, this has gotten his dogs out of the house. Having them socialize uh, together in a you know, COVID safe environment uh, with other dogs is really important as well. The problem is with the COVID dogs, the people are leaving them in the house. So when they come outside and they see another dog, they're like, what's that? Oh, these are these people. So that's why I tell them to come to training um, here or we're gonna have um, virtual training coming up January 12th for the people that can't make it down. Next, we learn how to master leash walking. So if I want the dog to walk by my side, then I keep it by my side until, good. And we, we have it nibbled just like this. Every time I take him like, out for a walk, he's pulling on the chain. Well, I think that's the mistake I'm making. I'm, I'm, I'm not doing enough feeding from my hand. Absolutely, and, and, and that's the mistake that everybody has. So what happens is, is the bowl becomes more important than you. This can be fun for the dog. Good. Okay, let's go. Come, 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 come. And again, I don't say anything, nope. Good, I wait for the behavior. There you go. Let's go. I'm a balanced trainer. I believe that the dog should be rewarded for the good behaviors that, that we did. Same as Wilson. If he doesn't do those behaviors, no, I'm not gonna give this to you. So dogs are my passion. I love, I love dogs. I love what dogs do for people. I love what dogs do for me. I'm Mikey Hood for PTL. Did it not just make you smile and brighten your day to see all those little puppies running oh, around no. in the room? So and cute. I can't get over how cute Wilson is. What a cute! I just want to snuggle him. <laughs> and Mikey tells us Unleashed is hosting in-person group classes, personal training programs, and online too, as they mentioned. And as you heard, they also have doggy daycare and a boarding program. And we'll have all the information you need at PittsburghTodayLive.com.